All right, gotta make this quick. 16% of battery, as always. That's the whirly sound of my fan. So, I watched the other day um, the new <laughs> Children of the Corn. It's new because it was released this year, but it was done in 2020. I think they they filmed it during lockdown because, you know, safety and all that stuff. And it was like, oh, cool, they were able to, like, get away with it because it's an indie thing. They should have just shelved it. I'm gonna be honest, they should have just fucking shelved it. Counting this movie, I think there's, like, a dozen Children of the Corn movies. How many movies do you need of, like, children being psychotic and then killing a bunch of adults? You know? I've only watched the first one. I haven't watched any of the other ones. I mean, it'll probably happen down the line in my life, <laughs> you know? But I thought, okay, they're doing, you know, like a, a redo of Children of the Corn. L let's see how it is, because, you know, it, it's been a while. Apparently there was a remake back in 2009, you know, when I first started doing these videos. But anyway, so we know the story. You know, it's a small town in Nebraska. For once, Stephen King didn't make it in Maine, but I don't think Maine has cornfields. Anyway, so... You know, um, town, crops are shit, and then, you know, kids start having, like, a w uprising and start killing the adults, you know? And then, like, this unsuspecting couple comes through, and then they're like, it's a town full of children, and, like, one adult, you know, the one guy who's at, like, the gas station or something, you know, because kids are like, how do you pump gas, you know? Um, so anyway, so it, it's like that. That's the original one. This one didn't have like it just it's just not good this movie like the, the 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 lead older kids who are like 18 you know who are like just you know hitting adulthood they're acting <coughs> bless me like it is like some fucking oscar movie they're like what is this we can't do that ah acting you know all that stuff the main child who's supposed to be kind of like the isaac malachi one it's a little girl this time she's just kind of like wow like she's like in a bloomhouse production kind of thing where she's like it's something crazy i'm a crazy child look at me i'm a crazy child you know kind of stuff and it's like okay um and the adults are just kind of there. Like, all the people, all, like, the grown-ass adults in that movie are just like, it's a paycheck kind of thing, you know? And so, like, yeah, the crops kind of suck. And then, like, the, the 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 older girl in the movie, she's like, you know, she's a big know-it-all. And she's like, hey, not know-it-all, that sounds mean. She's a smart kid, not a know-it-all. She's a smart kid. She's heading to college because she's going to do microbiology because, you know, like, the, you know, there was, like, dying plants she's like oh no the spores and the da 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 you know microbiology things i'm saying i went to art school i don't know <laughs> and it was like oh my god and so you know you're like cool a smart kid then there's like the older kid who's like you know grows weed and has like grandma's old like you know 66 vehicle whatever shit it's like okay cool but then yeah like this little girl like the movie start okay i'm all over the place but the the just the, how the movie made me feel so the little girl, like, some dude kills a bunch of kids in the orphanage kind of stuff, and then they ask the little girl, and she's like, I wish she killed all of you, you know? And then, of course, as an adult, you're like, the fuck? I don't know. I, I would have just been like, to the kid. <laughs> if a kid is like, I wish you were dead, I'd be like, all right, you know? Was it in, like, the Twilight movie when, like, uh, Dakota Fanning's character just, like, picks up the child and throws it in the fire, you know? <laughs> that would have been me, I'm just saying. If a kid says something really weird and creepy in that way, I'm just like, into the fire, that's where you go. You go have sandwiches, you know? So, there's also this weird, like... Oh, God. There's also this weird, like, CGI corn monster Groot-looking thing, you know? Because, like, the, the older girl, the microbiologist kid, like, she's, like, looking through, like, all the corn stalk. And then you just see, like, something kind of move. And she's just kind of like, huh. All right. And she kind of, like, leaves. She's still kind of like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> there wasn't this moment of, like, huh, movement. Oh, shit. Out. She was just like, that's just odd. And she just, like, saunters away, you know. Um, but, yeah, it's like this fucking 
it, it looks like, I'm saying it's like Groot because obviously it's, it's like a freaking tree, but it's not a tree, it's corn kind of thing. But the way how they like have the, you know, the corn stalk on the body and the color of it, it looks like Swamp Thing, you know what I mean? Anyway, it's poorly CGI'd, you know, it, it's one of those like, wow, that's a ones and zeros, you know, it's like watching like the Spawn movie and you can like taste the 1997 CGI, it's like that, you know, but a movie made in 2020, you know, and that, that monster thing comes out and like rips people and you're like, sure, you know, and then it, all it is, it's just that this little girl is just so like enamored by like the Red Queen from Alice in Wonderland and she decides to just be like, we're gonna sacrifice this pig or go to whatever thing and you're like covered, the kids are all covered in blood and she's like, yeah, you know, because that's my kid logic. And I'm just like, what am I watching? You know, of course the adults are like, the fuck are you doing, you little shit? The adults are like handcuffed in a cell and like the police station, the kid like comes in with like some fucking gas stuff and she puts on this mask and all I kept thinking is like, honey, that mask is not gonna help you with whatever gas you're gas chambering the adults with. Like it looked like, it, it looked like she just took like a, like a, like a jock strap. That's the best way to put it. It's like she put a, a jock strap on her face, you know, made eye holes, and then popped like a freaking like big old bottle cap on her mouth like that. And then she's like, I can breathe through this. Okay, girl. And she's like, <sighs> with this thing, and all the adults are like, <sighs> you know, all that stuff. And it's just so dumb because it's like all the kids are like, yeah, we're gonna uproar against the adults. Ah! You know, and then like the two like older kids slash newly adults are like, what is going on? And then the one kid who was like, I'm gonna stop this, instead of like slowly being like, all right, there's like two kids with bats, let me like subdue them, because they're kids. He just decides to like bum rush it, and then one kid smacks him in the back, and he's like, Grr! and then the other one, as he does that, smacks him in the front, and then he's just all mangled and he's gone. And it's like, wow, okay. You know, it's it just, that, that, that's just the movie. Like, there's no, there's like, it doesn't make sense. You know what I mean? There's really no rhyme or reason. It's just that this just happened kind of thing. You can say it was probably the dead plants, the spores, because like the microbiologist kid kind of goes off about that for a bit. You know, that causes hallucinations, and you're like, that could probably be the case. It's the happening. That's what this movie is. It's the happening. Um, it was just like... I feel like if I've never seen the original Children of the Corn or, like, know the story, I would just be like, what? I would think this is the hap- it's like fucking, like, Bird Box all over again where, like, this is the happening. This movie is the happening. Why are we redoing the happening, people? Please fucking stop, you know? <laughs> like, um, and, yeah, it's just not- it's not good. It's not- it's not good. I- I put it on. I did it to myself. I didn't have to watch this. You know, I mean, I later watched, like, John Wick in the Super Mario movie because I was like, this is fun, you know? <laughs> this is, like, a movie, you know what I mean? But I was like, oh, hey, you know, I haven't gotten my fill on, like, random horror that came out this year. Let me, yeah, okay. I was like, yeah, Evil Dead Rise. And then I'm like, this thing. Ah! It's just not good, man. Like, it's just not good. And it's, there's just... You know when a movie is short, but it feels long while you're watching it? Yeah, because the John Wick movie is almost three hours long, and that went by so much faster than this movie. I think this movie is like 80-something minutes long, 90. You know, the usual amount a movie is. And it's just like... It's so bad! It's just... It's just... It's a, uh, yeah, I don't know. That That's all I have to say. It's a short review because it's just bad... Because there's not much to say besides the fact that, like, everyone's acting on all different, you know, spectrums of acting in, a, in one movie. And they, they didn't know what the fuck they were doing. They were like, we're gonna do this, you know? And like I said, in the future, I'll probably watch Children of the Corn 2 to blah, 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 remake after remake, you know? Especially since, you know, we, we, we're kind of, like, hitting that, like, 
you know, downhill slope of people wanting to redo Stephen King again after the it boom, you know what I mean? Because, like, in the 90s, it was just like, yeah, Stephen King, you know? It was just like, all right, 70s, 80s, Stephen King with the 90s was like, yeah, Stephen King, and then it just kind of, like, went away. And then there were, like, little bumps here and there of, like, oh, yeah, that's a Stephen King thing. Okay, yeah, you know, you know. And then when it happened, it was just like, oh, shit. And then all of a sudden, you got all these, like, adaptations of, like, Stephen King again. Like, oh, blah, 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 blah. And we're at this part where we're just like, we're, it's just like, it, you know. So maybe people could just chill out and not choose Stephen King for, like, a minute. Or maybe not choose things that have already been done. You know, do, do those, like, well, one dollar ones that he puts out for people you know that you can do you know or or like maybe one of his like non-horror things i don't know remember he did shawshank you know <laughs> like something i don't know just don't just don't you know like just... oh my god also like amityville has like 20 movies anyway i'm done we're, we're done camera's blinking <laughs>